Hi, my name is Brandon Van He, Senior Manager of Clinical Education for Steris. Today we're going to show you how to assemble the Steris Robotic Arm Instrument Card. The Steris Robotic Arm Instrument Card provides a mounting surface to hold and maintain position of the robotic arm during the sterilization process. For example, here is a completed robotic arm instrument card. The first step to construct the robotic arm instrument card is to create the distal end holder. This is created by folding on the creases to create the end, then fold the two side tabs and insert them through the slit in the base, like such. At this point, you can insert the distal end of your robotic arm into the pocket formed by the distal end holder. The robotic arm instrument card features a window for instrument identification. To build the housing around the proximal end of the robotic arm, fold up the card around the robotic arm and position the keyhole eyelet around the shaft of the robotic arm instrument. Pull the belt up from the base of the card and insert it through the slit in the housing to secure the proximal end. The last step to assemble the robotic arm instrument card is to fold down the finger ring on the back of the proximal end. Steris also offers other products to complete packaging prior to sterilization. The robotic arm instrument card features two tabs that can hold a Verify Steam Integrating Indicator. The assembled card can fit into either a 6-inch or 9-inch Visual High Temperature Sterilization Tubing that can be cut to the appropriate length so that each end can be heat sealed prior to sterilization. The robotic arm instrument card also provides a set shape if you would prefer to use sterilization wrap. After sterilization, the robotic arm instrument card features two separate retrieval rings, one on each end of the card to assist with aseptic presentation. If you have any further questions or interest in the robotic arm instrument card, please contact your Steris representative.